Hello, your doctor has recommended that you need an insertable cardiac monitor or link device. This video will tell you about the monitor and how it will be inserted at one of our clinics. The insertable cardiac monitor is a small device that helps your doctor diagnose and treat problems with your heartbeat. It sits just beneath the skin of your chest and continuously monitors your heart. It detects abnormalities of the heart rhythm, which we call arrhythmias. Arrhythmias may cause symptoms such as dizziness, palpitations, shortness of breath, chest pain and fainting. The cardiac monitor makes automatic recordings, but by using a handheld device you can also activate it to record your heart rhythm when you develop any symptoms. There are a number of benefits of having a cardiac monitor inserted. It can diagnose the cause of symptoms such as fainting much more frequently than other forms of testing. This means your doctor can recommend the best therapy for you. As the device monitors your heart rhythm before, during and after the onset of your symptoms, your doctor may be able to identify whether your symptoms are related to your heart or not. Knowing this is especially important if you have had your driving license taken away from you. If we find that your heart rhythm is normal, your doctor will know to look for other potential causes of your symptoms. There are some risks to having the cardiac monitor inserted. You should discuss these with the doctor or nurse. As with any procedure, there is a risk of infection. The clinician performing the procedure will ensure that your skin is cleaned thoroughly beforehand to reduce the risk. There is also a small risk of bleeding. Although the device can be inserted in patients taking anticoagulant therapy, such as warfarin or any of the newer oral anticoagulants, if there is bleeding, this can be easily stopped by using a small electrical probe. You will not feel it because we numb your skin before the procedure. There is a small risk of an allergic reaction to the material that the device is made from. Please inform your doctor about any allergies you have. You will receive a letter in the post inviting you to have the cardiac monitor inserted. If you cannot make the appointment, please contact the hospital on the number provided so that your appointment can be rearranged. You do not need to do anything to prepare for the appointment. You will remain in your own clothes during the procedure and we do recommend that you wear a buttoned shirt that can be easily undone. When you arrive at your appointment, you will be met by a member of staff who will answer any additional questions you may have. If you are happy to proceed, they will ask you to give your agreement for the procedure to go ahead. You will be asked to remove your shirt and to lie on the examination couch. Your skin will be then thoroughly cleaned. The person performing the procedure will inject some local anaesthetic into the skin. This may sting at first, but should then become completely numb. We will check that it is numb before proceeding any further. A small cut will be made and the cardiac monitor will be inserted underneath the skin of your chest. You will feel the pressure of the device been inserted, but it will not be painful. In the majority of people, the device will not be visible. Once the device has been inserted, a very thin plaster called a steri-strip and a transparent dressing will be put over the wound. These dressings need to stay on for 7 to 10 days before you can remove them yourself at home. The whole procedure should take about 5 to 10 minutes. As the anaesthetic wears off after the procedure, you may experience some minor irritation where the cardiac monitor has been inserted. Taking painkillers from your pharmacy or supermarket will help to relieve this. The link device connects to some home monitoring equipment which records your heart rhythm. You will be shown how to use the equipment at this or another appointment. You will be given an identification card which explains that you have an insertable cardiac monitor, when it was inserted and what it does. You should carry this with you at all times, so keep it in your wallet or purse. The battery in your device lasts three to four years, after which time it can be taken out. It may be taken out earlier if your doctor decides that you need a pacemaker fitted to help correct a problem with your heart rhythm. 
it is safe to travel when you have an insertable cardiac monitor, including traveling by plane. We recommend that you let airport staff know that you have the device and show them your identification card, as it is likely to set the alarm off when you go through security. If you have any questions about the insertable cardiac monitor, please ask your GP or hospital doctor.